Hi guys, Chris from JNS again. Um, Akito have brought out uh, a range of um, clothing called the Typhoon range. So they do a glove, they do a jacket, they do a trouser. Um, and we've got all three of them here. So I thought, so I thought I'd show you a few of them. Um, the jacket comes in three different colourways. This black one I've got on, um, the grey uh, and uh, black that's here, and they do a flow yellow one as well. Um, trousers, I'm also sporting, and they're just plain black. And the gloves, you might see in another video, again, they're just plain black. Um, basically, it's an entry level um, range of clothing um, just to combat the UK's weather. Um, but it's not going to cost you a fortune um, and they're quite nice designs, they're okay for what they are. Uh, but of course Keto has been around for a while um, and they've always made some great stuff, great entry level motorcycle clothing um, and these aren't any different. Um, let's show you the jacket first of all, I've got the black one on, um, a good waterproof body armour jacket generally speaking, uh, three quarter length as you can see. Um, it's nice, it's comfortable, it fits well, the cut's quite nice. Uh, I'll show you some of the features on it. This black one you can't see it quite so well, but on the grey one you can see it a little bit better. Looking at the front there, you've got some patch pockets here on the front, which are fastened by press studs. Both of those there. Um, you've also got a folding pocket there to slip inside on that one side. And then a smaller oblong shape pocket to go on there. Don't really know what that does, but I'm sure if you've got anything of that shape, you can pop it in there. Fastening uh, is with zip and Velcro and a press stud on the neck. Just on the front of the neck there, they've got a nice piece of neoprene, just so that on the front here, where you fasten it up, some of the materials can be, it can be quite aggressive on your skin, and it's nice, nice and comfy on these. Um, that little section there, as you can see, undo that press stud, and you've got some patches of Velcro, covering, concealing the main zip, and a stud down at the bottom, and then you've got the storm cuff there. Now basically that's there to reinforce the waterproofness uh, and keep it away from the zip. So if any water goes in this side here, it hits that fold and runs down the inside rather than running through to the zip. Of course most zips aren't waterproof and this one isn't, so you've got to keep the water away from the zip. Open it up inside there, there's your toggle pull that down and it reveals a removable thermal lining. So there is a thermal lining inside there but you can take that out, it's removable for warmer weather days. Um, you've also got the connecting zip to connect to the trousers. So you can zip it all the way around 360 degrees and you're all fastened in together, keeps you warmer, keeps you safer. Little pocket on the inside here as well. Now this pocket will be waterproof because it's on the inside of the liner inside here, the exterior pockets tend not to be. So don't put anything like your phone or your, I know a lot of phones are waterproof now, a phone or your wallet or anything, you don't want to get wet. If you're out in heavy rain, make sure you put it in the inside pockets. There's also some pockets here on the inside of the, of the liner as well. So you've plenty of room for, to stash plenty of stuff. It's got body armour, shoulders, and the forearm and elbow. There is also a space for a back protector in the back. It's just got a body shaper in there for now just to show that that's where the back protector goes. But you can always upgrade that and add to it if you want a back protector inside. The adjustment, there's some adjustment on the uh, arms as well and the cuff there. Fastening there with Velcro, dead straightforward. And you've got a couple of press stud adjusters there which are elasticated around the the arm there just to pull it in if you feel you need to just pull that body armor a little bit closer to you if that's what you desire depending on what you're wearing underneath obviously if you're wearing something that's got longer sleeves it might be a little bit tighter in which case you can loosen it off turn it round onto the back just to show you the back pretty straightforward a little bit of reflective piping there and the Akito logo and also the adjusters on each side of the waistband You've got those on both sides so you can pull it into the waist and just pull it in if you're a little bit for a, a little bit more snugness or let it out if you're wearing a little bit more underneath. It's a nice jacket, nice colourways, entry level price, nice quality, guaranteed waterproof, um, Akito Typhoon. Um, three different colourways, I like it, you can't really beat it um, and I think they're a, it's, a, it's a nice range of clothing altogether.
If you like the video, don't forget to hit the, the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you soon.